<clears throat> hey guys, Team Soul Gaming here. This is Chris. I just want to share with you this game. It's pretty much my first game playing Corky, my first uh, normal game playing Corky, and uh, we were learning new champs recently. Um, so I played Corky uh, ADC. Then we had Zach. He played Gragas, and uh, uh, I played. Uh, he played Gragas, and uh, Mike played Shen. He didn't play Shed in a while. So I'm going to <clears throat> show you this game. At first we did pretty bad, but we had some good escapes. We made a lot of calls together. A lot of lack of wards, though. We could have had more, I I, I think. Um, but yeah, it was. Other than that, it was pretty good. Uh, and here here's the team we were up against. It was uh, Garen, an Ezreal Zed, uh, Varus, and an uh, Ari. So here they are. I'm just gonna talk over this. Um, it was a pretty long game. Um, I might cut my mic soon though, just so you can watch. Uh, yeah, they tried. They all rush sack at this point. Um, yeah. Minions have spawned. All right, I'm just gonna mess around with this. This is my first time uh, going over this. All right, so. Just gonna leave it on directed for a little bit and then I'll change it over. But yeah, this was a really good game on our uh, our pre-made, our little league team we got going on. We need a support still. If you play support and you're watching this, please. I did pretty bad at the beginning though, in my opinion. We're getting pushed hard. Now that Jinx came out, this freaking Jinx is o OP as ball sack. We played a few games against Jinx. It's pretty bad. <laughs> um, I think at like 10 minutes in, or after I get the first kill. Yeah, I, I got killed first. Varus tried to tunnel vision and he got killed. That was really, really bad. Big mistake we made early on, which uh, gave us a huge disadvantage. Um, but we got our bearings and we got back up uh, we've been live streaming too by the way so you should go check us out uh, we're gonna live stream every Friday on the weekends this Monday even too because uh, we have that off uh, school everyone I guess in Illinois I don't know around the world or not around the world but around the US I don't know though some districts are different alright so we will go to me now I don't know how to uh, take this away. Alright. Alright, so I'll just walk you through what I did. I was doing really bad at the beginning though. Really cool uh, how League Replay, how you can do this. Well, it was a really good game. I I got a Penta almost last game that I played. I live streamed it. It was a Quadra, but they had an AFK player. I was so mad, man. Would have been my first Penta. Uh, so this game, yeah, I, I was learning pretty much all of Corky's moves and combos. I only, I only played them two games before that in a bot, bot matches. If you get a new champ, the best way to learn them is through bot matches. I don't know why people buy champs to go into normal games and they expect to do good. We played with a Jinx that just bought, uh, she just bought Jinx, and he did terrible. He was like feeding them so hard. That was a good uh, kill I got there. I thought I picked up the double, but Varus got the first kill. So that was my first kill I got. That was pretty nice. Uh. We get caught out a few times by Ez. Uh, he has his ultimate. His, uh, I forgot what it's called. Chew shot, I think. But, <clears throat> but yeah. 
Uh, one main thing you really need though is wards because look where Varus is coming I could have got ganked if I stayed and tried to engage and fought them. Um, we always use a lot of callouts though when we play. But I'm a lot better with Corky I feel now even though I did pretty good with this game. Cause last game we uh, they were at our nexus no turrets no in hips and we defended with a half nexus like the nexus had half health it was pretty sick and we came back and won we aced them five times after that we were so underfed and then we got fed so we can see we spam that a lot <laughs> the uh, call outs but at least it's a good thing we use them though because it helps out a lot especially with no wards we were like telling them to buy wards the whole game I really don't buy a lot of wards so I had to back out of that situation. You don't want to tunnel vision uh, too much, I guess. Because, like, I had to use my flash. Um, that's a good juke. And Ezreal got me there. There's Zach is. First time playing Gragas owned. Actually, he died, but whatever. The more we play together as a team, the more, uh, the better we get, I feel. We have been progressing a lot recently. I'll show you what I built on, uh, Corky this match. I pretty much just looked up a good build for him. Um, I, uh, what I built on him was, uh, Fearer Berserker Greaves, I got a Last wi this is not in order, by the way, a Last Whisper, Bloodthirster, Infinity Edge, uh, main thing was Trinity Force, I might say, that was a really bad engage, um, and a Guardian Angel, but the last game I played, I tra uh, traded out Guardian Angel for a uh, Phantom Dancer. So I got caught out here. I thought I was gonna get Varus, but it's bad on my part. <clears throat> got got cocky. Those three deaths, those are three huge mistakes I've made. Overextending and everything. Which I can't blame myself because it's my first time playing my Corky. In a normal game at least against people. <clears throat> I'm saving up a lot of uh, IP for runes. I have like 9,000 now. I could buy Jinx alone just with IP, but I, I need to buy runes soon. I have absolutely no runes. It's important you buy awards, though. This game, we the only person pretty much buying awards was Zach uh, and... Mike, Shannon, Gragas. <laughs> so let's see what I have built so far. I have, uh, I did pretty bad CS at first on this game. I have 40 CS. Um, right now I'm building, um, as you can see, I'm starting to build a Trinity Force. I have a uh, Zeal and I have Sheen. And I was working on building my Berserker Greaves. It's, it's really important that you buy boots in the. So make sure you buy boots if you're new. Because you'll need them. It's one of the main first things you want to buy. Not the, like, not the first thing you want to buy, but one of the first things you want to buy. It's boots. I usually buy boots after I start building my first item. Whenever I have enough. They're not that much. They're 325 gold. And I got caught out again almost there. I got a good escape. Used my flash though. As I go over this, I see when I use my barrier. I use my barrier and flash at the same time just to save me. But I might end up changing out barrier for a... Uh, Ignite or something or exhaust because 
I'm pretty much just wasting it when I use it, and I can pick up so many more kills if I had ignite. Just times where they just escape with like a hundred health or eleven health, it's around there. We didn't have a jungler this game, I don't think. Let me check. I I can't check actually. I need to see their the there we go. Perfect alt by Zach, which helped a lot <clears throat> for me to secure that kill. Um, we didn't want to get baited there because we knew they were. We thought they were in the jungle together, but they weren't. It's good to stay cautious, though. Play cautiously, smart. Especially in uh, team battles with team comps like this. Garen, there he is. Picked him off. Got another kill. Just They're just helping me get fed, pretty much, so I can do the big damage. That was a really bad engage right there. Uh, Zach picked up the kill and Sh uh, Shen got that kill. I got that kill, so it was a perfect three. Our team, our pre-made, pretty much perfect uh, trade-off of kills. So means Zach back here. <clears throat> I think I bought my T. Uh, yeah, I bought my Trinity Force and my Berserker Greaves. I think now I start building my. I.E. my Infinity Edge or my Bloodthirster. Garen back there, we could have got him. He flashed and wasted. Picked up another easy kill off of a mistake he made. It's important you don't make big mistakes like that. I could have got that, but Varus picked it up. Uh, Varus, with his Q, got a lot of kills off of me. I took a lot of kills, but it, it didn't honestly matter. Honestly. <clears throat> But a good thing with Corky's ult is that you can spam it in your R. You can keep using it and then you can get a, after I think three or four alts, you get a, a supercharged one which does super big damage that you'll see. I picked up a triple kill today, just, they were running away and I just used it and picked up a triple with it, it was really easy. Right there we had a really, 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 really crazy engage. I picked up the kill. Um, I picked up the double nice, and then uh, our Jarvan got shut down. So I am building my Bloodthirster now, because I bought Vampiric Skeptor. Um, if you're gonna clear lanes, I would use Phosphor, the Q and the E, which is Phosphor's bomb, and uh, your I don't know what the move's called. It's a uh, it's that Gatling gun, though. I think it might be called Gatling gun. Gurky's a really strong champ once you get built with him. Especially if you have Trinity Force, you do tons of damage. So right now they're getting Dragon. Um, so... They just got a ton of gold from that. Um, map objectives are key. Their Ezreal had a good engage there, but didn't help them. Shen picks up. Mike picks up another double kill, uh, which is pretty nice. It was really good on his part. So right now we're just Korean, Korea rushing. Korean rushing. That's what I'm going to start calling it, because every time Korea plays, it's pretty much Mike thought of it. But... They just rush, they just do five man rushes to turrets and just take them super fast and like six, like five minutes in. It's insane. So it's 26 minutes in now. <sighs> Some good engages. Ferris picks up that kill. I get this one, I'm pretty sure. Just getting fed, yo. Varus alt, he snared me. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this is a really good game now that I'm watching it back over again. There Varus is. I remember we had a pretty good engage here. He dodged that ultimate, which saved us. Saved me and Shen pretty much. Ari was there, but we left Varus to die. I don't know why. Uh, Garen was there though, so we probably would have got picked off if we hadn't. So, 
we had to sacrifice him. <laughs> Blue team's turret has been destroyed. So here they are trying to push our turrets now, rushing. Uh, we pretty much shut them down here though. Really good trade offs with our team. We're pretty much getting equally fed here. It's not one person carrying, which is really good. Now I'm watching it back. We had a lot of nice trade offs. Ezreal coming towards Jarvan. I had to rotate mid. Uh, clear that wave. Excuse me. Uh, I've been playing a lot of GTA, so. And a lot of school sports and athletic stuff that's been going on. That's why we haven't been uploading so much as we have. Um, Garen and Zed came, so I lost my red buff there. Uh, I couldn't go in by myself because I had to. I wouldn't have survived. So I lost my red buff. I was pretty mad. <clears throat> um. Where Ezreal is? Ezreal did a lot of good combos this game. Props to him. He did pretty decent. At least damage wise he did. I don't know what his score was. As you can see at the top we uh we were at a huge uh money disadvantage. <laughs> and now it's tied up twenty seven for twenty seven. Including turrets, I think. No, they have four turrets, we have one. So pretty much we were losing this game, I guess. Pick off another kill there. Easy as. Easy, easy. Easy, easy, G easy. My nigga. Zach gives me that camp so I can get some lifesteal, but I think I end up backing. That was a fail, W. Blue team has slain the dragon. Yeah, they, uh, Mike picks off Dragon there with uh, Varus and Jarvan. Um, they went to go get Baron, I think, but I don't think it was even up. And then team fight here. He tunnel visioned a little bit, which was bad. Just picking off CS though. I did really bad in CS. I really didn't CS that game. This game really be honest just bad on my part now that I'm watching this I need to get more I need to practice a lot more on CS so envious Mike gets that kill pretty easy I try to save him here so he wouldn't get killed by Garen and then I Varys picked him off I got the assist along with uh, Mike and uh, Zach huge fight here I try to go in and pick one of them off alright uh, Mike saved me with his uh, ultimate there and Zach picks off the double which gave us the ace which was pretty good but that Ezreal ult I remember playing this game like surviving that and then that happened we were all cracking up I was really 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 good I feel like their Ezreal should have used the ult more cause he could have got a lot more kills if he was uh, using his ult more he only used it to pick off one or two champs when they were low, so which is pretty useless. He could have got a triple kill, a double kill at least, a few times actually. Zed pushing bot, he's going through uh, river now. Uh, I met up with him, and we uh, went our separate ways. Good disengage there. I didn't want to engage him with three people there, four people there actually. And then they rotated, uh, half rotated mid, and then half uh, the rest of them rotated top and backed. So Zach picks off a turret there. We're even, almost in turrets. Uh, Ari coming from this way. I picked her off. Nuked her, and then I saw Ezreal was coming with Ferris with her uh, because of Zach get another kill there I just try to pick off that kill but I think Mike gets it or he got away yeah. 
important you don't run past turret when stuff like that happens because I see people tunnel vision all the time uh, we wasted uh, Ezreal's TP because I think it was t one Ezreal's TP someone tried to TP on turret multiple times and we took the turret out before they could teleport So it's four for five. We're starting to catch up in turrets now. We're leading in um, gold and we're leading in kills Lucas now. Um, we have a 2k lead. Um, there, Garen wasn't playing very smart at all. Used my W to get that quick kill. Ezreal and Ari got away though, which they were really, really low, so. That was pretty bad. I should have used my W over the wall, picked off Ezreal and Ari while they were running, and let Zach get uh, whoever I killed. Don't know what I was doing here. Alright, uh. We went for Baron. But it wasn't there, I don't think. I know it was there. One of the times we won, it was gone. And Zach engaged. They're pushing mid while this was going on, but we gave our team a Baron, and we barely missed them, so. Oh, I picked uh, I picked um, Zed off just pretty easy like that. He's really low running away. I don't know what happened to him. I... That was a perfect W in my part, and then a good alt, a good, uh, what you call it, a good ulti from, uh, from Zach Gregus. That was a good play right there. They were trying to give me the triple, though. Um, right now, my build is, I have 115 CS, and right now I have, um, Trinity Forest, a Bloodthirster, and a Last Whisper. I'm building at the moment Infinity Edge. And I have a Fearer. What you call it? Fearer Berserker Greaves. Which helps me do. This build helps me do big damage. With Corky. Um, might make a guide on Twitch soon. But. I've been doing a lot better with Corky, so I don't know. We're just pushing him back hard, trying to play aggressive to get them out of there. We run into Ari right here. I was going to W over the wall, but I made a mistake. I did it at the thicker part, so I couldn't. She flashed, escaped. Then we went for Varus. I picked him off really easy. With my R, I had my ultimate, my uh, the big one charged up. So I'm just trying to life steal now. Right, what is my score at the moment? I'm 16 and 4 with 20 assists. And here is where we try to end the first time. I don't know if we get it or not. Zanya's picked him off. Got the double kill. I had to back off for a second. I don't know what I was doing. And I don't know why I'm backing. I think I'm trying to finish my build, probably. Oh, yeah. We, uh... We didn't want to end the game at first, because we just were doing so well together. As you can see, uh, Shen and Gragas, uh, w uh... They were doing pretty good, also. But I was carrying in kills. Big time. What was my CS? I didn't have as much CS. I need a CS more. Oh, yeah, this was a really bad engage on my part. I don't know why I went in now that I'm rewatching it. Why I did that, but that was complete retard mode. Dra Dragon's up in one minute. Uh, but I don't think we go for Dragon anymore. Now they're just placing wards like crazy. And they 
pretty much ace them besides Zed. And then I go bot lane, I think. I just got a text. And we ended it there when me and Zach engaged uh, Zed. So we had pretty good score. We uh, I built my complete build um, almost. I was the last thing I was building was um, Guardian Angel just for the whatever. So I had an Infinity Edge, Trinity Force, Bloodthirster, Last Whisper, and Berserker Greaves with the Fear Enchantment. And a war, or not war mogs, but the uh, that chest plate. I don't know what it's called. I forgot. Um, Zach did really good with CS. Um, this was his first like legit game playing Gragas, and he he he's doing really good with him now. He's been what the hell? He's been um raping face with him. Uh, there's his build, and then Shen's build at the bottom. Um, and yeah, so. It was a really good game for us. Um, hope you guys enjoyed watching that replay, and uh, I'll see you guys later.